My name is Zach Everhart. Hi, I'm Phoenix. I'm Farside. Hey, it's Tice. Hey, this is Aaron Turner. I want all you guys to subscribe to Synergistic. Vote for me and subscribe to Synergistic. Now. <laughs> when I first met Aaron in season nine, um, I felt like a kid. Uh, I was 18 years old, fresh out of high school, um, just kind of seeing what was going to happen through it. Now I feel like a grown person. <laughs> I feel like a real, like a real adult. Um, I, I think I'm a lot more confident now. Um, I think I've grown immensely in my technique and strength. Um, man, getting to see Aaron again was so awesome. Like just the fact that I haven't seen him since we got cut. He slayed last season, and then he comes back, and it's me and him tapping on stage. There's just something special about that. He's not even the same person. Like I said, I said that he's he's really not. I mean, he was 18, season nine. I was. 23 maybe 23 24 um, he was young you know he was um, he wasn't as comfortable as he is now because his growth like you said is literally just I mean it is it's been incredible and I was so blown away by him and the way it's it's difficult when when you're pulling different genres you know especially for a tapper to go outside of your comfort zone and every single time that he was handed an obstacle I literally think he exceeded everyone's expectations every time well, I mean, a piano man is typically a bar song, so I thought that the story of uh, of Aaron being the bartender and Zach being uh, just a patron of the bar, I thought that would be something that would be nice to to tie in the song and the use of the prop. It would set a mood and it would set a set a feeling for the piece. And uh, the guys executed and danced it beautifully, and they did a great job. I've known both of them before, so it was a it was pretty easy process and a, and a fun process. Tonight my duet. Oh, that's a really good question. Um, tonight my duet with Valerie was really was really fun um, for me because I got to be the complete leader. Um, I love being the guy. I love being the man on stage. Um, so before we went on stage, I was like, Valerie, give me everything you have. I need all your trust. Put all your weight on me. So I love doing that. Um, and it was definitely a challenge for us, like not being able to look in each other's eyes or, or anything like that. Uh, but it was it was a beautiful experience. What I loved about the piece and what I thought was really interesting is that he loves her regardless of the circumstances and I think that that's something that's very relevant just now in the world with not just this subject about her not being able to see but I think in the you know loving someone regardless and Zach is so great he was perfect in the role and yeah Zach Crazy. is incredible and he's just a pleasure to work with. He's just like, he will, he will not stop until he gets it right. Perfectionist. It's really, really, really yeah. great. I remember, yeah. uh, um, this past year, uh, I kind of went through a little bit of depression. Um, I wasn't dancing as much as I always have. Um, so I think that this show has really rekindled that, that fire that, uh, that has, always has been inside me. Um, but now, like, it's pushed me to, to leave. I don't want to stay in Atlanta. I want to get out. I want to dance forever, all day long. I'm never going to forget the first time that I really looked at Zach differently because when they made him, when they first went into the show, outside his style, and when he went into that full leotard, and then he was full into character, didn't even worry about, oh, man, I feel stupid in this leotard. He just went full out. That's when you know you fell in love with Zach. Can you rap for me, please? Actually, I didn't come prepared today, but maybe we can rap together or like maybe have a little battle next week. I don't know if you can handle my battle. Ooh, that's a challenge right there. Someone's getting cocky. So next week, it's on, girl. It's on. Be ready. Synergistic I'm bringing, I'm bringing my A game next week. A game. Y'all aren't even ready. He doesn't even know. You won't even know. <laughs>